Hey guys, Anita here with Celebrating Home. Just want to share with you a little bit about our stoneware. This is our number one selling piece. This is a bean pot. Every home needs a bean pot. They're available in many different colors. You can, as you can see on this little flyer, shows the different uh, designs and all that we do have in the line. But the one that I'm featuring today is called the Paris Nights Collection. And I'm going to share with you some quick recipes that you can use in our stoneware, where our stoneware is different from everyone else's, okay? Our bean pot is uh, made of pottery. It's a stoneware uh, item. And uh, you can put it in the regular oven. You can put it in the microwave, in the freezer, and also uh, it goes in the dishwasher when you're all finished. It's like a stone oven because it is made of the stoneware, the pottery, and so it just works like a stone oven in that everything you cook in magically tastes amazing. Let me share with you a real quick recipe that you can use uh, for this. One of my favorite recipes to use is uh, a lava cake. You can take a lava cake by using a cake mix, and this one what we're, uh, I'm going to share with you is our family favorite, and that is the German chocolate cake mix. You take the uh, can of uh, coconut pecan, which is the matching frosting that goes with this. And what you do is you take this cake mix, you put it inside, you put all the ingredients that's listed on the back, the water, the oil, and the um, eggs, and mix that all together inside here. And then you have your raw cake mix. On top of your raw cake mix, you open this up, you drop dollops on top here. Then you put the lid on, you put it in your microwave, and you bake it for anywhere from eight to 10 minutes. When it comes out, then everything is inside here. The icing has oozed to the bottom, and it's like a lava cake. It is absolutely amazing. Another great one to use is a chocolate cake and a chocolate icing. Then you have a chocolate lava cake. So you can kind of experiment with that. But don't think that the bean pot is just for desserts, because one of the, my favorite things to do with it is to cook vegetables. You can put uh, corn on the cob in here, just either frozen or fresh. Put a half a stick to a stick of butter inside. Put the lid on, put it in your microwave for 10 minutes, and you have the best corn on the cob you've ever tasted. You can take boneless spare ribs, put those inside, put a cup of your favorite barbecue sauce, half a cup of water, put the top on it, put it in the regular oven at 350 for 45 minutes to an hour, and the meat will just fall apart. You can almost make a barbecue sandwich out of it. So it's just one of our favorite pieces. It's one that can be used for many different things, and it's a featured item for the month of February. All right, so let me set that one aside and share with you the next item that I have. The next item I have in our stoneware is our double serving bowls. They come in the set. Again, we have many different designs of these, and it's made of stoneware. Because it is made of stoneware, you can do the same thing with this that you can do with our bean pot. You can put it in the regular oven, the microwave, the freezer, and the dishwasher. All those things can be used with these items. And uh, you can even, I've even baked in this. I'm gonna share with you how you can bake in this item. You take a cake mix, and what we're gonna use this time is gonna be a devil's food cake mix. You take any cake mix, any pie filling, and three eggs. You take those, we're gonna put them inside the, the large serving bowl, mix them all together so that there's no dry ingredients, everything has to be moist. Put a plate on top of this, stick it in the microwave for about 10 to 12 minutes, pull it back out, let it sit for just a little while, and then when it cools a bit, you can flip it and you'll have a cake that's the shape of the bowl. And you can just kind of sift a little bit of uh, white powdered sugar on top, or you can drizzle some things, or you can just decorate it really pretty with some whipped cream designs. But it's a beautiful cake in itself. And that's in our double serving bowls. So again, that's any cake mix, any pie filling, and three eggs. You can experiment and use your own favorites, but Black Forest is one of my very favorites on here. Another great thing to use with our double serving bowls, we have a double serving bowl stand that you can purchase. And the little stand is great. I use this on my kitchen countertop all the time, and I have uh, like vegetables and fruits and things that sit inside here, maybe little cuties and apples and bananas, so I have those on there, uh, always at any, any time that we want a quick snack. But you can also take this and put your large bowl in the bottom, small bowl in the top, I use it a lot for like our black bean dip and put the chips in the bottom and that way you've got a chip and dip and it's kind of decorating up, taking up less space on your kitchen counter when you're using this and it's a beautiful display of your food also. You know, a lot of the part thing with food is the display in it. And then the third item that I'm going to share with you are our 9 by 13 uh, uh, dishes that we have here, the casserole dishes. This one is the newest one. It even has a beautiful design on the inside. Now, I realize you probably have Pyrex and other things in the house, but you really need a really nice stoneware dish. These do honestly cook different than your Pyrex pieces. So what I want to share with you on this one is another quick dessert. And this one is one that's been around the internet for a while. What you do is you take an angel food cake mix. And you take one 20-ounce can of crushed pineapple. Take these two items, 
put them in a bowl, mix them up really well, and then uh, after that, they'll start to foam. After they do that, then you're gonna pour them inside your nine by 13 pan. You're gonna put it in the regular oven at 350, and you're gonna bake it anywhere from 20 to 30 minutes, depending on your oven. You'll see it starting getting to golden brown on top. Pull it out, and it's just like a sponge cake because it is an angel food cake mix. Another thing that I cook inside our nine by 13s, is a new recipe that was just given to me and it's called chicken spaghetti and with chicken spaghetti what you do is you boil your spaghetti noodles and you put those in the bottom of your pan and then in a separate bowl you take one can of cream of chicken soup one can of uh, cream of celery soup and then you also take two cans and they're located where the canned tuna is of like the white uh, chicken breast and I use the large cans and then I also take one cup of uh, chicken broth, put all that in a bowl, mix it really well, and then pour it over the top of your spaghetti noodles. On top of that, you sprinkle mozzarella cheese. Put that in the regular oven at 350 until the cheese starts to melt. It was a hit at our sales meeting the other night. So it's another great dessert there. Hash brown casseroles, many, many things that you can bake uh, in these items. So I'm gonna end up just real quick with one last thing about the bean pot. You know, we talked about the bean pot, how you can make desserts in it, how you can make vegetables in it. When you're all finished, if there's still food inside, you can stick it in the refrigerator uh, to keep it for storage. You also can take it out and when it's all finished, you can put it in the dishwasher when you're completely finished and need a quick cleanup. You can put it in the freezer overnight. And when you pull it out, it's gonna stay cold for two hours. It'll stay warm two hours and when you take it out of the oven, it'll stay cold about two hours after you take it out of the freezer. Put your potato salad or your gelatin salad, take it to a picnic or a social, and you've got a great dessert there or a great meal right inside here. So again, our stoneware pieces are just something that's very unique and different, so you need to go to the website from the person that's sharing this YouTube video with you and see about getting some of these items because every home needs some celebrating home stoneware. Thanks, you guys. Have a great day.